Hi guys, welcome back to a new juice review and today I'm going to show you the juice I bought from Future Juice Labs in the UK and this is called Strawberry Something and it is something pretty good. Um, what I found though, um, okay let's just start from the top, this is a 120ml bottle, um, price was $19.99. <clears throat> And it's a 70, 70 30 yeah, uh, VGPG juice. Um, and the profile is supposed to be a strawberry cheesecake kind of vape. Um, but what I found was, because I've had this juice for, I don't know, for a little while now, I did find it took a while for any sort of crust, kind of biscuity notes to come through um but now i've had it let it steep for at least you know a month or so um yeah it's coming through more than it did i was just getting kind of like a tangy sh ripened strawberry i was getting at first um but smelling it now yeah it, it's, it's it does smell pretty good and I can't vape right now because the smoke alarms have been going mad. I can't smoke uh, vape inside, but um, <clears throat> yeah, I've been vaping this uh, on and off for a, well, like I said, about a month. I've got about bottles. Uh, um, sorry, the levels down to <clears throat> about here. It's about about there. Yeah, just oh, they're the two guys that actually created this juice, um, Coil Turd, and I think it's a yeah collab with. Vinyl and Vapor, I think his name is. Guys, uh, the guy does like, um, oh, what are they call the uh, deep cuts. I haven't tried that line yet, but that's his line. And he, Coilter, does obviously coils, uh, but also does the um, Boule Bolu, I haven't tried, and Peach Tea Lemonade, which was his uh, first one. So, not really my, those are not really my profile, not the, um, well, I'm not too keen on banana, the peach tea lemonade, that's not really my thing, even though I do like lemonade, but I, I'm more of a bakery kind of vapor, uh, bakery with a fruit, or just straight bakery, but I do find this has more strawberry, I'd say at least, I'd say it's about a 60% strawberry with 30 to 40% bakery notes in it. I wouldn't say it's a clean cut 50 50 i'd say you're getting more strawberry with this which is not terrible it is it is quite a nice dessert strawberry um <clears throat> but yeah no it's um i'd say it's worth it if you like a strawberry cheesecake kind of ape you know um just trying to think anything else i left out on this one um Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to say as well. Because um, my last video was done on this guy, Casitos, and the um, coffee, cafe con leche, and I put it down as coffee con leche, but you know, same kind of thing, but yeah, muddled the English with the Spanish. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, these come in, obviously, a 100 mils filled to the top, which makes it difficult for you to add your nick shots. Whereas this is how I would prefer it in a bottle like this because I don't know if this one is imported from America unless this is produced here and we just got like the uh, recipe and we're developing it here and this one's imported which might make more sense actually because this one like, you can see the, the height difference. So that extra height you can um, you know obviously you can put your nick shots two nick shots it will filter the top this one i struggled to get in half a nick shot so maybe if it is possible that future juice labs can do that larger bottle if not then i'll just have to keep doing what i'm doing or just order from america that's the only other options really we've got because obviously we can't or um buy three milligrams plus in these big bowls it's just not allowed i suppose but um yeah, guys, if you have any questions about this juice and um, any of the other juices I've done beforehand, just give us a comment. I'll um, reply. 
and I'll look forward to doing some um, new juice reviews as I get some more juices. <laughs> All right, guys, well, stay safe and take care. Take it back.